Ho! What is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster, and welcome to a brand new indie horror game from the same makers who did The Shopping List, which, if any of you saw the playthrough of that, I had a special appearance in. Um, so the developer reached out to me and said, hey, I made another game. You should check it out. I was like, yeah, absolutely. So this is Broken Through. Uh, it's a free game over on itch.io, and I just know that it's a psychological horror game. So let's go ahead and start this game, see where this leads us. Always very excited to check out some new little horror games that are out there. I think this one is a little bit less than an hour long. Okay, reading time. Ava Williams' son, Leo Williams, went missing. Countless investigations and countless searches took place, but no glimpse of where he went. Seven years after this incident, Ava Williams got a letter saying that Leo Williams was declared legally dead since they never found any evidence as to where he went or where he is now. Okay, got it. It's a little bit of a missing persons case. We'll see where this leads us. Oh. Ava Williams. Well, that should be everything. Okay. How do I proceed the... Oh, space. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by. I know Leo would have wanted you to have some of his stuff, knowing how close you two were. This sounds like I'm one of his friends. But anyways, I guess I'll head back inside now. Drive safe, okay? All right. Take care. Bye-bye. Oh, see ya. Let's get all these boxes on the truck. All right. I, I, li I like the uh, the tube TV kind of effect that's going on here. It's pretty cool. Cardboard box. Okay, eat a grab and just toss in the back of the truck. Yeah. Cool. Box time. In the truck. Another box. Tossy, tossy. And last one. Let's fit it back here. Objective, get in the car. Okay, do I have uh, like an objective list? Anything else? Ava, I have questions for you. What do you want me to do with the boxes? <laughs> All right, well, let's get in our car. Enter the vehicle. Cool. Yeah, I like the style, style already. Always great to have these kind of retro inspired horror games. Broken. <gasps> Through. Great little title screen. <laughs> Created by Jordan Lindgren. I hope this isn't copyright music. <laughs> Maybe it is. Well, I guess I'll find out. <laughs> Usually he has like this kind of old, old music in his games, or at least the shopping list when I played it. And that music seemed to be just fine. So we'll see how this goes. You might get some random jazz music replaced in otherwise. Oh, baby. WASD to control the vehicle. Oh, yeah, we're going to run across the road. I'm feeling the midnight munchies. Yeah, we got to we gotta stop by the old quick corner. I'll stop by 11-7 and get a bag of chips before driving home. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Love me some 11-7. Oh! I just stall out. <laughs> ah. 150 meters away. All right, well, let's make our way uh, downtown. Get to the 11.7, get some delicious munchies. Uh, for me, gotta get some type of delicious chips, but also some type of gummy candy. I really, really enjoy Nerds Gummy Clusters. Those things are so freaking good. <laughs> All right. Ba -da -ba -ba. Here we are, 11.7. <laughs> Perfect. Enter 11.7, let's go. What kind of delicious snackies are we gonna get today? I wonder. Bum bum. Objective, get some snacks. Yo, what up, dude? <laughs> How you doing? Breakfast combos? Love it. What does that say? Treat? Take? I don't know. <laughs> Happy KA partner? <laughs> Fruity things, big gulp. Yo, green beans, canned corn, bushes, baked beans, Hunt's tomatoes, Campbell's chicken noodle soup. Yeah, they got all, like, all of it in here. All right, oh dude, we gotta get a, how do I, how do I have the slushy? Where's the cups? Inspect fridge, all these drinks are knockoff brands. It's unfortunate, very unfortunate. Slushy machine covered in ketchup, gross. Normal slushy machine. All right, I need to get some chips, spicy noodles, beans, corns. A lot of soups. Yo, I'll, I'll take some cup noodles. Top ramen. <gasps> Doritos nacho grease. Doritos cool stank chips. 
Cheeto, cheese toes, and lazy's chips, and fat chips. Love it. You gotta love the cool stink, Doritos. <laughs> I really, really enjoy the spicy nacho Doritos. And if you get them in your area, Tapatio Doritos, so good. They're so good. I shall purchase some chips, please. Hey, I'm just getting these chips. <laughs> All right, let's see here. That'll be $2. Behold it! Do you really want to buy that bag of chips? It barely has any chips, just air. Uh, yeah? <laughs> Maybe I could interest you in buying my own brand that I'm working on. Jordan's Jolly Jipper. 0% air, 100% chip. I even made a commercial for it. Uh, I don't think I'm interested. Sorry. <laughs> Do you want to see the commercial? Maybe it'll change your mind. Um, <laughs> use the arrow keys and enter to her. Hey, you know what? Let's check it out. Yes. <laughs> see you. Jordan's Jolly. <laughs> Hi. Yes? What's your question? <laughs> the audio is so weird on this. Have a jolly day. Thank you. Nausea, diarrhea? <laughs> Those don't sound like good chips to me. Anything else? No? Okay. <laughs> good enough. I like your commercial. <laughs> what the F? <laughs> Please buy it. Uh, yeah, I'll buy your chips. All right. <laughs> Thank you. I'll give it to you for a dollar. Special friend price week. <laughs> but anyway, it's $3 for the two bags of chips. All right, uh, here's, here's, um, 69,420, oh, okay, there you go. <laughs> Thank you, I knew it was a good businessman. Anyway, have a good day. Uh, bye. <laughs> give me those chips. <laughs> All right, get me out of here. I, I assume that the guy in the video was the actual developer. Ba -da -ba -ba Let's head home. Okay, sounds good. Ba -da -ba -da into the vehicle. Where we heading off to? Let's back up out of the 11-7. Rip, 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 rip. Head on uh, over here. Quite a distance, but shouldn't be too bad. I like the chill lo-fi <laughs> beats to study to music that we're listening to. Pretty good, pretty good. I, I was never one to watch any of those lo-fi beats like stream videos. I know everybody loves them so much. I, I, I remember I heard at one point something happened to the channel, like the, the lo-fi hip hop girl. Um, and like their channel went offline for the first time in like years and it was a devastating thing for so many people. Very sad indeed. All right, let's get out of the car. Let's figure out what's going on with all the stuff in the back. I'm assuming I need to take it out or is it already in my house? Look, look at this, look at this beautiful little home we've got on this quiet, quiet neighborhood. Surely nothing will be going wrong here. Let's enter the house. <laughs> See how things go. Based on a recurring childhood nightmare. Hmm. Based on a real life recurring childhood nightmare? Hey, yo, I'm gonna eat some Jordan Jolly Jippers. Ooh, crunchy, crunchy. What am I sitting on? Am I just squatting in front of my couch? Oh, that's enough TV for tonight. Okay, sounds good. Well, what are we gonna do now? I would like to eat some more of my 100% chips, 0% air deliciousness, but uh, I guess we'll uh, just head on out. Exit the living room. Hello? Well, I may as well open the boxes before heading to bed. Okay. Where did I set those boxes? Enter bedroom now. Frying pan. Blender. Refrigerator. All right, where are my boxes at? Ah, open box. Bunch of books. Okay. Ugly clothes. A game? Oh, interesting. Should give it a try on my computer. I guess we should. 
And then what's in here? Posters. Okay. <laughs> this man had some taste. Well, let's grab the game. Go use it on our, uh, inspect the door. I'll stay inside. It's cold outside. Okay. Hello? Into the living room. Now there's nothing in the living room. Let's go to my bedroom. Let's bring the game in there and see what this game is all about. Newly made bed. Wow, it looks so comfy. So comfy and cozy. Why do I minmo cat food? A lot of cat food. <laughs> I don't see a cat, man. Are you just eating cat food on your own out here? <laughs> Hopefully not. Man, what a cozy little bedroom. We got our bed in the corner, our little side table, cat food in the other corner, and our little gaming station. <laughs> All right, let's sit down, insert the game. Is it on an old disk drive? The classic. Controls. Use arrow keys to move slash navigate. Select, interact with enter. Oh, okay. Got it. Fourth world. Yeah, let's go ahead and start the game. 1989, Shattered Studios. Blum blum. Ah, okay. Are we sure we can't use WSD? No, not at all. All right, well, let's get our little guy moving. Let's see where we head up. Hi, who are you? What's up, dude? Can I talk to you? Can I interact? Interact. You have a choice. Okay. What's my choice? Okay. I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> Interesting. I can't look around in the real world. I'm stuck just playing the game at the moment. Is it getting darker? It is. It's getting darker in the game. Uh-oh. What was my choice? Oh, I don't like how long your arms are. Hi, buddy. Don't continue down this path. Okay. What are you to tell me what I can and can't do, buddy? I'm gonna continue down this path. Uh-oh. I don't like the rumbling noise. Uh-oh. Is it still getting darker? I can't tell. Hello? Oh, I don't like that at all. Oh, I don't like that at all. Can I, can I interact with you? I don't think I can interact with you. <laughs> okay, let's keep on moving. Beware of the man in the coat. I think you're the man in the coat, sir. I'm gonna keep on walking. Yeah, don't like his face. Don't like anything about that really tall man. Okay, we're just gonna keep moving. Keep on moving. Everything's gonna be a okay. Is that the man in the coat? Oh, we're, we're moving extra slow. Sir, I don't want to like the way that your face looks. It's very tiny and hard to see. But it's very creepy. Hi. I can't move. <laughs> Breaking through. <laughs> what the heck? He has broken through. Oh no, that's my house. <laughs> that's my house. E to get up. Oh. Oh no. Objective, exit your room. What? What? <laughs> yeah, I'm out of here. Don't you worry, I am out of here. Rut row. <laughs> Hello? The door shut behind you. Oh no, what happened to my room? This is not my house, this is a tunnel system now. I'm in an underground mine shaft all of a sudden. What is that? The game has just begun. 
Yes. Nice little sign to introduce me. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. <laughs> okay, what are we going to run into? What does this one say? Finish four of his levels or undergo a fate worse than death. Is this what happened to our friend? I would only assume so, since this was on our friend's belongings before he suddenly disappeared. Is he stuck inside the game forever? To finish a level, locate the door. Got it. Not too hard now, is it? It's getting dark. It's getting kind of dark. Okay, what does this one have to say? Beware of the entities. Oh no. Uh, okay. I'll do my best to beware. Oh boy. Number one. What? What's happening? It's just bringing me into door number one. <laughs> I did not expect this. This is not what I wanted. Oh boy. I can't walk back out. Okay, what does this say? What do you want from me? What's going on here? As I crossed the bridge, I had tears in my eyes, and I simply imagined myself diving into the water and drowning myself. Tom Thomas. Who is this Tom Thomas? Okay. Is this some type of riddle? Okay. <laughs> I found the door! I'm walking through it! Did I beat your first level? <laughs> I hope so. Oh. Strange. Level one, the bridge. Oh. Okay, so what's up with the bridge then? And what are these entities that I need to keep an eye out for? Okay, I hear stuff below me. Sounds like some whooshing, sloshing water. Oh yeah, that's very wet. That's some very wet water. I see it. Oh, nice little boat. Why are you whispering at me? Stop that. Stop that! Hello? Somebody out here? Oh, I hear coughing. Tom Thomas? Is that you? Pass with care. I wonder why. Is this where the entity hangs out? Perchance? What does this say? Look through. I'll, I'll bite. What am I? Oh. Little figure just hanging there. Don't know what I'm gonna find here. A little scared to turn around as well. I'm not gonna, not gonna do that. That's for sure. Oh. Oh, that sounds like somebody drowning. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. Pass with care. It's all blocked out. It's totally fine. It's totally fine. Everything's fine. Okay. This sure is an easy level so far. Ooh, ooh. Oh, keep going. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Oh, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. Can I move faster? I can't move faster. I can't move any faster. What, what, what is going on down there? The whole tree growing out of his face. <laughs> okay, got some weird spikies. Weird spikies growing out of the water. It's the giant squid tentacles. <laughs> Strangely, they're conical in shape. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think I've moved fast enough to get past that guy. Jump. I'm gonna try it. Let's let's go. Ooh. Well, oh, my guy got some hops. My guy got some serious hops. Okay, surprised I made that. Could have sworn I was just gonna fall straight in. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Is this, is this land? There's the door. Get in the door. Get in there. 
Enter? Question mark? Yes, please. It's the door that we've been wanting. Right? Sure hope it is. Where am I? <gasps> number one. Oh, we've opened the door for number one. Okay. Nice and simple there. Now we got door number two. Door number two waiting for us. Let's see what's behind door number two. What little limerick, little puzzle piece are we gonna get for this one? Is this all of the people that went missing that played the game? This is all of their fates? Sometimes I wish I could just close my eyes and then be in a better place when I open them again. Tom Thomas, no, it's always Tom Thomas. At least the first two doors are. I wish I could close my eyes. I wonder if there's gonna be an eye opening and closing mechanic for this particular one. I guess we shall find out. Hmm, what are we gonna get this time? Oh. 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 We got colorful circles all over the place. Press. Um, sure, I got nothing else to do. Okay. Anything against the walls? No. Got a key code. Ah, so red, green, blue, yellow. So it's gonna be however many dots there are. So red, green, blue, yellow. Red, green, blue, yellow. So red, we've got one, a two, three, so three. Red, green? Yep, green is next. So three. There's nothing on the things. So three. There's one. Two. So three, two. And then blue. Three, two. One. Two. Four. And then yellow. So three, two, four. Three, two, four. One. Three, two, four. Three, two, four, one. Sounds about right. Three, two, four, one. Three, two, four, one. Nice. Level two, the staircase. Yeah, I was like, there's no way it was that easy. Hello? I'd like to leave. This feels like that SCP where it's just the unending staircase. I feel like that's what I'm diving into at the moment. Wish I could close my eyes and wake up in a better place. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. I'm gonna sneeze. I'm warning you right now if you're listening with headphones. Close them immediately when you see him. Oh, it is. It is the eyeballs. Left click to close your eyes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I gotta sneeze, too. This is not good. Oh, I thought there was someone standing there. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh. What is that? Trash bin. Why is there a trash can here? <laughs> it's trying to trick me. Close your eyes immediately if you see him. I don't know who he is. Oh, oh, I just expect him. Oh, I got so many chills right now. I just expect him to be around every single corner. <laughs> is he still there? I don't think I saw him.
Do the trash can? Bloody trash bin. Oh. Covered in blood, you say? The sneeze has passed. It's... Still kind of lingering, to be honest. Sounds like he's behind me. Is he right here? Oh! What was that? What was that? It didn't look like a person, but it was something new! Okay, open my eyes. Missing. <gasps> Those were real eyes behind it! Sounds like he's right next to me. Ah! Ah! Ah, this is the worst one! Hello? Are you here? Are you in here? Oh, it's just the wall. It's just the wall. Where is the door? Give me the door, please! <laughs> the eyes are closed. The eyes are closed! <laughs> what was that? Okay, glad to know. At least now at this stage, it's a giant jumping out massive face, not just someone hiding in the dark. Is this the fate that this man went into? Oh, I hate those eyeballs. I hate those eyeballs. Oh, boy. He's missing, all right. That's for sure. Oh. 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 They're all looking at me. I don't like it. Where'd my trash can go? What if I need to throw something away? <gasps> trash can has returned? My goodness, and in a different spot altogether. Much larger, too. Well, thank you. <laughs> it's exactly what I needed in this moment of <laughs> need. <laughs> Hello? Can I get the door now? Please? And thank you. Eyeball. <gasps> Don't let them through. Seven deadly sins? One, two, three. <laughs> what is going on? Close it! Come here, come here. Come here. Oh, there they were coming. There's, there's somebody there. Oh, close the door! Close the door! Oh, that's a lot of doors. That's just open. Come on. 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 We're good at this. We're doing our job. <sighs> stressful. This is stressful. I'm stressing out. <laughs> Go faster! In the corner. Oh, I see you. I see you. Hi. Hi. Are they all gonna open? <laughs> Stop it. Oh, can I leave? <laughs> I have escaped. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Door number two, you're done for. All right, only two more doors to go. Let's go into number three, challenge three. I think I believe in myself. We can get through this, no problem. All right, what does Tom Thomas have to say this time? What's his little, his little deal? When me and my wife got divorced, I could still feel myself crawling after her. 
in the darkness crawling after me. Tom Thomas. Yam Yamas. <laughs> Such a strange thing to say. <laughs> he was crawling after her and the darkness was crawling after him. Gosh, that sneeze is like just just chilling up here in the sinuses. So sorry if I'm like snooping around. Oh! Well then. I guess this is Die Hard Simulator. <laughs> Yippee ki yay. Let's get through this <laughs> air vent. Level three, the vents. Okay, any other info? No? Okay. Am I just supposed to find the right path? Is it just a giant maze? Like, what am I looking out for? <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm gonna be sniffing a little bit. Uh, to be honest, I've been very sick. Not very sick. I've been uh, dealing with like a weird congestion cold thing for like the past week. Uh, in fact, I have this is the first video I've recorded in quite a few days. I luckily got a chance to uh, record some videos in advance before I got sick. Surprise. Uh, that's. That's where I'm at. So, finally feeling good enough to record this video. So, sorry if I'm like a little sniffly. I'm sure most of you don't mind. Whatsoever. Ah. Something's chasing me behind me! Something's chasing me behind me! Go faster! Oh gosh! Go faster! This is like one of my greatest fears. This is <laughs> oh, I hate this! Oh, I hate this! Go faster! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Go faster! Please! Please! I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is, and it makes it so much worse that I can't see it. <laughs> right or left? I'm going right. Right was the right choice. Right was right. Faster, faster, dude, faster. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You think they're gonna do, do a double right? Faster, man, go faster! I can't go any faster! Come on. Come on. Down. Come on! Come on! Oh, Okay, where, where did I land? Oh, I beat it! Oh, fantastic! I'm gonna go this way now. The final door? Oh gosh, that was terrifying. I don't know, even know what that was. Chasing after me in the vents, but... <laughs> My goodness, it's so scary. Stuff like that is so scary. Just being chased by something that you can't see, but you can hear it. It gets me every time. All right, what does this say? What do you got, Tom Thomas? What's your last thing? I am done. I finished the game, and now I feel much better. I feel like a different person. The man in the coat. Oh, the man in the coat. No, thank you. Is Tom Thomas the man in the coat? <laughs> that sneeze is still just chilling, like right up here. Right up here. <laughs> Stage two. I'm sorry. Level four. Fourth world. <laughs> Okay. Well, let's figure out what I need to do. Can't blink. Moving at a general pace. Oh no. Speak. We are all as human as you are. You are our only hope to save us all. Tom Thomas has been corrupted 
by the entity, including his game. The entity transformed his creation into an endless loop in which Tom Thomas relives his darkest times in life over and over again through each level. Interesting. The entity feeds off, I'm assuming, torturing the innocent by luring people into this corrupted game. But if you bring Tom Thomas back, you bring all of us back. All right, I'm gonna do my best. I'll try to save you all. Inspect the orb. <laughs> Inspect the orb. Orb time. Hi, is that Tom Thomas? Hi. Barney Gray, missing since 5th of January, 1992. Hi, Barney. How you doing? Got anything to say? Is that you? Are you Barney Gray? I can't actually speak to him. Another orb? It's like Pac-Man. I'm eating all the orbs, but they're actually people. <laughs> oh, it's the long arm man. Okay, who are you? Carlos Bull, missing since 12th of September, 1993. Last seen buying a game. <laughs> Very creepy. Very creepy. The weird music spliced into all of this just really adds on to the effect. I really hope none of this is copyright, but I, honestly, I might just leave it in, just because it really does add to the uh, the aesthetic of everything. Oh, you. I forgot about you. Dave Owens, missing since 3rd of May, 1994. Last seen in his bedroom. Oh, Dave, buddy, you're not looking so hot in this <laughs> pixel world here. I think Tom Thomas is gonna be up here. Hey, you just kinda appeared out of nowhere. That's a big orb. No, this is our friend. This is gonna be a friend. <laughs> Leo Williams, yeah. Missing since 2nd of March, 1995. Last seen playing a game by a lake. There he is. Leo, my friend. What happened to you, buddy? Tom Thomas? Oh, it's you again. Many people who have gone missing have actually just ended up here. And this is me. Do you know anything about Leo Williams? Ah, yes. He is the one who has gotten the farthest in the game out of all of us. Out of us all. Are you too close by any chance? He was my best friend. He went missing seven years ago and we all thought he was dead by now. Well, in that case, I could help you catch up to him. There's a glitch on this map that will spawn a door. This door will send you back to your reality for a very short amount of time. If you manage to make it to the same place where Leo was taken into the game, you will end up at the same level as Leo when the man in the coat brings you back into the game. To do the glitch, all you need to do is spam the space bar when you're a bit further out. Also be cautious when you're back in your own reality. The man in the coat might try to kill you for breaking the rules. Good luck. Oh no. <laughs> Alright, when do I spam the spacebar? <laughs> Unknown error! Get me out of here! <laughs> that was good. That was, that was really good. This is just gonna like shoot me out of the computer. Oh, it just reels. I'm gonna be chased by that man in my real life now. Um. Hi. Frank Pan. I don't know what to do actually right now. Light switch, why would I turn the light switch on? Ah, we well, keep the lights on 100% of the time. In a spooky environment like this. Let me check out the living room. Get in here. Okay, I'm assuming I need to go to my car. Yeah. Let's get to my car, and we gotta go. We gotta get to the lake, apparently. Object objective, drive to Leo's last known location. Oh gosh, I don't like the strange red atmosphere that's going on here. 
Okay, it's off to the right. Sweet! <laughs> Let's go! Alright, where's this man? Why is it blood red out? It's actually very close to what it looks like sometimes in California. Keep your eyes on the road. I really want to look around. Okay. There's the conical tentacle. <laughs> uh, typically, there's whenever there's a major, major wildfire in California, which is kind of often, um, unfortunately. But whenever there's a lot of really major wildfires, like really close by to where I live. Um, oh my gosh, this guy will turn such a deep, like orangey red. It's very sad, but uh, it's obviously not like this dramatic. Oh my gosh. But it has this kind of feel and aesthetic. It can be pretty terrifying. Sometimes it rains ash. Actually, it just happened uh, a few weeks ago. So hot. It's like 100 plus degrees wildfires uh, somewhat nearby. Not super close to me, but close enough to where the ash was kind of raining down in some of the areas like in the morning. And then it just was pouring, pouring rain <laughs> like a day later. It's kind of wild. Park vehicle. Okay, let's get out of here. Where is our friend? Our friend's last location. The computer. Next to the blood sea. Start Leo's computer. Okay. The coat man gonna jump out again? Let's find out. Uh, away we go. Back into the matrix. See if we can bring everybody out of here. Oh, oh, oh! Console player two join level. What is this? No players online? <laughs> Great game. I still have not played that myself. Same guy who did Spookware. I think. Yeah, pretty sure. I like that the lights turned off. Who turned off the lights? Hello? Leo? Leo, right? Leo? Oh boy, I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Hello? 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 Oh, Leo? Leo? Please help me, Evan. Oh! Leo? Leo, I'm coming for you. Buddy, I don't know where you just went, but I'm coming for you. The man in the coat, final level. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> um, uh, how do I attack you? What the? <laughs> what? An unknown force is holding him back. Okay, what do I do? Do I hit the okay button? <laughs> unknown error. Hi. <laughs> Hello. What do I do? Can I grab any of this stuff? Save the corrupted souls to save Thomas. Okay, got it. Oh, hi. Are these the corrupted souls, I'm assuming? Save the four souls. Okay, what does this do? <laughs> so bright. <laughs> My eyes. <laughs> Level 32, despair. Player two join level. Find Barney Gray. Uh, oh, Barney. I'm gonna follow the uh, line on the floor. Seems to be the best indication. Barney. Hey, yo, Barney. You in here, man? 
Barney! I feel like this is a lost cause following the line, but... We're gonna try. We're really gonna try here. Barney! Buddy, you in here? Okay. Oh, this is a... This is an insane maze area. Barney. Barney! Where are you, buddy? Honestly, I might be going in circles. <laughs> Barney! Barney? Is that you? Why should I even try to progress anymore? I'm just gonna end up dead in another level. Barney, I'm here for you, man. I can help you if you help me. I don't need any effing help. I'm fine with staying here. I can get you home. Home? Yes. I just need you to trust me. Do you trust me? He trusts me. <laughs> He's beginning to believe! <laughs> okay. I trust you. Come on, Barney, let's go. Let's get out of here. One out of four souls saved. Perfect. All right, what's the next one? Level question, question. Dementia. Player two, join the level. Help Carlos Bull. <gasps> Carlos. I feel lost. Yeah, you're a bit lost in here, Carlos. Do I grab your record? Vinyl record. Let me help you remember. With one of your favorite songs. Add vinyl. Oh. I remember this. Ooh. I used to listen to this tune all the time. <laughs> the kids always used to beg me to turn down the volume. And me and the guys used to play cards while I listened to this. <laughs> oh, Nice little saving moment here for Carlos. Those memories warm my soul. Two out of four souls saved. Let's go. Okay. Only two more to go. Level 125. Depression. <clears throat> Help Dave Owens. Dave, coming for you. What's going on in Dave's house? Depression is a very scary one. Leave me alone. Hey man, is everything alright? Dot dot dot. No. What's wrong? I don't know. I just feel so empty. I hate the feeling and I can't even explain why I'm feeling it. Hey, listen. There will always be moments in life where you feel as if nothing matters. The feeling that you'll never feel better again. And an urge to give up on everything. But I promise you, it gets better in the end. Please don't isolate yourself. I'm here for you, if you'd like to talk. <gasps> I'd like that, actually. Dave, you're not alone. Ah! Thank you. Just a little friendship. A little friendship, a little, a little care. Went a long way for Dave. Three out of four souls saved. All right, what is the last one gonna be then? I'm curious. Level error. Grandson's safe zone. I like, I like the abstractness of this one. Kind of moving throughout these different, like, little worlds and universes. So what's going on with Grandson's safe zone, then? Oh. Hi. <gasps> Leo Williams. Have I been forgotten, Evan? Did anyone even remember me after I disappeared? 
You haven't been forgotten at all. I've missed you so much, Leo. And so has everyone else. Oh, poor Leo. Evan? I came looking for you, buddy! I want to go home. I want to go home too. <laughs> this is a crazy place inside of a video game. Four out of five souls saved. There were four before. I guess the last one is the Mega Man Save Tom Thomas. Is this the ink spots I'm about to play? <laughs> I heard boom, 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 Soul of Barney Gray. That's a little creepy. Oh, add soul. Blop. Leo Williams. Okay. Hey, buddy. How you doing? I see you watching me. A little, a little creepy there. <laughs> if I do say so myself. Wait, where did the other soul things go? Were they all just over there? <laughs> I could have sworn they were on each corner. It sounds like the beginning of 20 different <laughs> ink spot songs. <laughs> oh, they are. They're all just right here. I'm so stupid. Okay, well, let's put them down. I'll put this one back to where it should be, just in case it accidentally breaks the game. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Sorry. Just went around for nothing. Blop. Got the next one. Dave Owens. Souls in. Last soul. Carlos Bull. Lance. Oh, boy. You don't like that, do you, Tom Thomas? Why are you trapping everybody here? <laughs> I'm here to save you and all of us together. <gasps> Thank you, Evan. You've not only saved me, but you saved us all. I can now send all of you back to your families. Aren't you coming with us? I'm fine with staying here. You've already killed the entity. So by staying here, I can live in peace. Here, I can be truly happy. Hmm. But now, I think it's time for you all to return home. Thank you, Evan. Head on back home, I guess. Get a doorway. Return home. Can I interact with any of you? No? Okay. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I love the music that they put into this. <gasps> Missing boy found alive after seven years! Fourth world. Broken Through, created by Jordan Lindgren. Game design, Jordan. Level design, Jordan. Animations, Jordan. I'm assuming it's all made by Jordan. <laughs> Outside sources, freesound.org, Zapsplat. This person does not exist. Oh, okay, I was wondering where he got the faces from. Because they all look like they were modified in a crazy way. Special thanks to some playtesters. Various screams. Based on Jordan's recurring childhood nightmares. Very interesting. I wonder if all these songs are past the copyright age limit. Um, like I think after a certain amount of time, support me, Jordan. After a certain amount of time, stuff just comes becomes open source or not open source, but you know what I'm trying to say. Um, they're no longer copyrighted in the same way. That was cool. I really like that. Uh, broken Through. 
again, another very cool horror game um, from Jordan, and uh, glad he tipped me off that this one was released. I know uh, I play a lot of games from a lot of different developers, and so many amazing uh, games that are out there in the world, and it's it's really it sucks because I've played so many. I don't always know when a new game is out from a developer that I really enjoyed or if there's an update for a game. Uh, so it's always nice when these devs reach out to me and be like, hey, you played my game. Go check out another one. Um, and in fact, there's actually uh, another game I'm planning on playing uh, after this one releases. Uh, that is a continuation of another demo I played a while back. You'll see you'll see that one popping up here very soon. But um, yeah, Broken Through, very cool. Re again, really love the abstract kind of nature of going through these different levels, discovering the uh, different like worlds that these souls inhabited and the different levels that you had to go through to uh, like relive, I guess, Tom Thomas's nightmares. Some of those were genuinely like really terrifying trying to get through it. And um, other than the one part where you're like closing your eyes and opening them, that was truly the only like jump scare moment. But I was seriously way more terrified, like trying to run through the ventilation systems, the uh, the air ducts, <laughs> being like chased by some mysterious thing behind me. Very, very, very creepy. Um, but yeah, loved it. Fantastic work and hope you all at home enjoyed me playing through this one. But of course, if you did enjoy this playthrough, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment down below, love to hear any thoughts and feelings from you all. And if you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification that we know exactly when I'm uploading any new videos. And if you'd like to see any more content from me, you're welcome to follow me on any of my other socials like my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, got a Discord channel, and a bunch of other cool things always listed in the description <laughs> down below. But of course, that all being said, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.